My name is Awesome Crunch and welcome back to the wonderful world of Subnautica, where this episode we are going to try and make our sea base. Now, last episode we created our sea moth, which is pretty superb. In fact, it's outside there, just there, the lovely thing. If you want to see how we made it, go back to the previous episode. Um, there should be a full playlist on my channel by the time this video is up. So yeah, cool. So this episode, we are going to try and build an underwater base. I'm not sure where, I haven't found a suitable place yet, but also this video, I'm hoping that the aurora will explode or do whatever it's going to do. So uh, yeah, that's something that can happen. I'm just going to try it one more time, See, see, just, just to see, you know. Initiates ship explosion. Yes, so it's initiating the ship explosion. Whether I've just reset it and done a silly thing, uh, we will know later. But uh, I'm not sure when it's going to explode. But uh, we're going to go and look today for a place to settle a sea base. So we've got quite a fair bit of titanium that I collected off camera in the last s episode. I wanted to say series there. Last episode. So this is episode three. Um... And so yeah, we're gonna go find a suitable place to build a sea base. I do not want to just build a sea base wherever, because that's not how I work. I want to build a sea base in a suitable place that is resourceful, full of, rich of resources is what I meant. I can hear radiation. So I'm gonna go away from here. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna go away from here because I can hear radiation. What's this? We should probably get a radiation suit. We don't need that. Oh, that's our challenge. Right, we need to get a radiation suit. How much do you... What do you need for silicon? You need two quartz, don't you, for silicon? So we need to go on a quartz hunt. Right, let's go for a quartz hunt. Uh, there's the quartz already. Good start. Oh, I've also found some by accidentally spawning out of the ship in the wrong direction. Nice. Uh, just check around. Oh, yes, there's some more there on the left. Nice. Is that enough now, I think? I think the radiation suit took two silicon. Uh, and we have four now, I believe. We just collected three. So yeah, right, so we should have enough. Let's go back to our base. Our little life pod. Um, and get ready for whatever's about to happen. Right, let's go and get our radiation suit created because it will be v radiation detected here. Jesus Christ. What, the radiation suit requires a wiring kit? What the? I'm losing health in my own base. How is this happening? I'm losing health. Oh, there it is. Come on. That looks like fins. Did I click the right thing? I've stopped losing health. I'm gaining health. Nice. So you this... Oh, it's changed. Has my outfit changed? Has it? Has it actually changed? I'm not sure. Hang on, let's take it off a sec. Let's take it off. Yeah, it changed. Oh, that is nice. Oh, that is, that is cool. Right, so now we have a radiation suit on, which... Oh, that is so cool. Oh, wow. Oh, this game never fails to impress. So... Whatever's happening, something's definitely happening because radiation was not here before. Something is definitely happening. Something big is happening because that our base is no longer habitable. Although the radiation suit does appear to be making my hands bug in the night. But that's alright, it's an early access, I don't care. Right, let's go back to our original quest and begin finding a suitable place for our underwater base. I don't believe radiation affects it at all. So let's go... How about we go quite near the ship? Do you think that would be a good idea? I'm not sure whether that's such a good idea. We can hear the radiation. You're very near to it. I don't know if this will kill us, actually, though. If we're re really, We are quite close to it. So I don't know what part of the ship explodes, so... Um Yeah, the radiation field is definitely expanding because this was not in radiation last time, last episode. Our base was not in radiation. And now it is. So the field of radiation is definitely expanding. 
Whether that's a bug or whether it's actually supposed to be happening, I do not know. What is that noise? Oh, it's you, the gasopod. These guys are idiots. They're so annoying. These are one of my favourite creatures in the game. Go away, dude. Those, I think they're called rabbit rays. And they are... Look at that. They're so nice looking. Oh. Wow. Well, I forgot to stop my timer from last time. So it's now on 21 hours. Which is always good. Um, start again. Right, okay, so that was about five minutes, wasn't it? About-ish? Oh, I don't know. Be an extra long episode. Um, right, so where are we going now? Still trying to find an area for our base. Come on, dude, is the ship going to explode or what? Maybe it'll be a next episode thing. Oh, This is cool. How far away are we from our base here? Is it actually worth building it? Oh, we're reasonably far away. This might be a cool place to build. If we could, like, actually kind of fill up the front of this tunnel, that would actually be really cool. And, uh, there's some quite cool wildlife down here. Yeah, I think we'll do it here. I don't know if this is a good idea. Is there radiation in this tunnel? No, there isn't. Right, so we're in a radiation-free zone as well, which is uh, always good for our skin. Um, we should probably be building a bit deeper down, I'm guessing, but, uh, for the moment, this is our first base, so uh, leave that scrap metal alone. Well, it's our first base in this series. Go away! So, uh, I'm just gonna leave it as a plain and simple base. So, um, we need a f foundation. Whoa! Oh, yep, yep. We need a foundation to build anything. So, we're gonna build it right in the entrance to this tunnel. Lovely jubbly. There we are. Nice. I probably should have built that right. You can deconstruct, that's cool. Um,. I'm going to build it a little bit more in the centre. Like, like that. But things not, that are not in the centre annoy me greatly. Um, that's alright. It's nice that it makes it flat. Does it give it foundation? Yes, right. See, my hands don't seem to appear all the time. Strange, but you know, I'll, I'll, I can put up with it. Right, so there's radiation here now. Oh god. Does this have... Yeah, it does. Right, that's right. No change to the look of the ship. So, uh, um, is there still ra radiation is spread into the tunnel now? This is definitely happening. This definitely something is definitely happening, because that is just spread. The radiation is just spread. We just saw it in front of our eyes. A second ago, that was fine. There was nothing there. But now there's radiation. Nice, cool. Uh, so we need a hatch to get in. Damn it, we need glass. Right, how do you make glass? Um, see, I don't appear to have a hand, but, uh, you know, uh, you need quartz, I believe, for glass. Um, gold. Is that useful? I'll take it anyway. Right, I will go and make some glass, and I will be right back. Right, I am back, and I've got some glass, which should mean that we can now build a hatch. Yep, there you go. Only took me about, let's have a look, two minutes-ish to get the enough quartz. Because I already had two, so I just need to get one more. Um, nice. Oh, lovely, jubbly. Um, we should build a fabricator. We can always move it if we don't like the positioning. See, I have no hands. Very strange, but you know, um, we'll go with it. So yeah, there's our fabricator, unpowered. Right, we need to build a um, a power generator, which is two four, four times titanium, which is not as bad as I thought. I thought it would be like computer chips and all that. That's right. Oh, we can build it underneath. That's good. Wait, can it be underneath? Hoping it can be. Will that supply the thing with electricity? Because the the it's quite a reasonably ugly thing. So, uh, I'd like to keep it out of sight. But we also need to be able to get to it, I'm pretty sure. Can we get to it? Yes, we can. Right, okay. Does that give us energy? Does that give us power? I can't tell. I can't tell if that's giving us power. I'm guessing it is. Okay. Right, so where are we going with this corridor? Shall we see? Yeah, we're, we're getting... A 
Oh my god, this is possibly not a good idea to build it here because these guys are not going to leave me alone, are they? Because I've built in their biome. I've built in their habitat. In their habitat. Oh, I should have collected that bit of quartz there. Whoops. Gasopod, hello. No, no hand. Very strange. Very strange bug indeed. No, nope, no difference. But it is definitely spreading the radiation. Whether that's a sign of the explosion... What are these? Stalker turf? What are these for? Oh, I don't know. Let's leave them there anyway. Um, right. It's so strange not having any uh, hands, but you know, whatever. I'll go with it. Oh, the back. Okay, strange. So when you look that way, they... Okay, so when you look at a certain angle, they uh, they come back. Right, I'm thinking I'm going to create it so we have this here is going to be a L corridor. Maybe that I maybe I'll regret that. And then this will be a T corridor. Because what I'd like to do is eventually build this up so that there's like an upstairs and it kind of fills up the whole... Oh, I need oxygen. So it eventually b fills up the whole... The whole kind of area. So can you build it from in here? Oh, you can. Nice. So I'm going to build a window. Right, we need two more glass. Right, damn it. Okay, I will be back in a sec. I'll just go and find some quartz and then get some glass. Right, I'm back. I'm being attacked by a weird thing. Let's go away. Right, I've got the glass, I hope. Did I get the right? I hope I did. I'd better of. Yes, I did. Right, okay. So I'm going to put a glass window there. That's cool. Right, okay. So put a glass window there. You can see all outside because what I wanted was something that looked a bit like this. And then all of these will be windows of it. Oh, that looks so cool. Um, nice. So this will eventually probably... I'll put a locker here, actually, if I have enough glass. Right, well, that'll be something that we can do after. Right, we want to build it up. So I'm going to build a corridor up here. Come on, let me... Yes, you can. Best game ever. Come on, let us build it. Come on. It was thinking about it for a second. Come on. Oh! Oh yeah, you have to do that, don't you? Of course you do. Nice. So now, how do we get them to connect? Ladder? To connect it. Right. We need to go and find some more titanium. Right, let's all do that together instead of skipping it. Let's go find some titanium. How long have I been recording to? Eight minutes. Right. Well, I've probably been recording for about 13 minutes now. Um, I'm not sure whether that ship is doing anything or not. I'm not quite sure what it's doing. But uh, I'll go find some titanium. Let's go. Oh, hang on, that's not a good idea yet, actually, is it? Because the things that I've been looking for before that have all been near. I need to make a beacon, don't I? Right, I can't really leave this now, can I? Until I find a beacon. But I'm not sure how I'm going to make the beacon. Oh, actually, I have the stuff in here, don't I, occasionally? Copper wire, which is two copper. I have one copper. Right, I'm gonna go look for some copper, and I will be right back with that copper. We can get some copper wire, and hopefully that means we can now build a beacon. Nice. Cool, so we will put this beacon underneath here with the generator. And that should tell us its position. Nice. Right. Okay, the copper was just down there, so it wasn't too hard to come back. But uh, I was afraid to lose it with the titanium. So, um, cool. So there's our base over there. Wait, where's the radiation gone? Is there no radiation? Okay, right. Um, I really don't know what's happening, to be honest. Um, right, let's go back to our base a sec. Because... We need some more titanium. Actually, we can just hunt for some titanium now, can't we? See, it doesn't seem to be make, have any difference to the to anything, really, does it? I can hear. Can you hear that? 
Radiation. I can hear it. But maybe it's just given up telling me that there's radiation detected. I don't know. Let's just wait and see. So that's the episode over, guys. Um, in this episode, we've created our sea base. Kind of. Made a beacon for it so we can actually refine it. The radiation has, for some reason, reappeared in this area. So um, that's always a joy. Uh, we made it under this huge tunnel thing, which I'm actually quite proud of. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I think it's a pretty good idea because it's well protected from most things and it looks pretty snug. So, uh, I will have to change that T corridor into a uh, X corridor, I've just realised, because I want to build backwards. But, you know, we'll have to settle for it for the moment. But thank you guys, I have been Awesome Crunch. If you're liking the series, share it with your friends, like it, and subscribe if you're feeling extremely generous. But uh, until next time, I will see you in the next one. I just don't. So uh, here's our seamoth, our lovely, lovely seam. Oh, oh, that's. Oh, I didn't know these guys did that yet. I knew they were there. I wasn't sure what they were there for. Oh, that is awesome. Nice. Right. So here's our lovely seamoth. There it is in. All